We're going to try this again, folks. I'm James Williams Jr. We're going to come for habit number two. This is my nephew. His stomach's a little irritable, so he may surprise us. And there goes somebody ruining my video. So we're going to try this again. Chinese actor with a name that I can't pronounce, but I'm going to spell it out for you. Y-U-N... X I A N G Gal slapped Sydney woman as producer raped her. Jewelry's here. A Chinese star, a Chinese film star, laughed and slapped a Sydney woman as a male producer raped her in a luxurious hotel room. The jury heard. Woman gave a tearful evidence on Wednesday about the alleged March 2018 attack by a TV and film star. We're going to call him YG, because I can't pronounce the name. YG, or Y Gao, and the Chinese producer, Jing Wang. I can pronounce that. Probably didn't pronounce it right, but I can pronounce that. J-I-N-G, Wang, W-A-N-G, Wang. Boy, if you're going to be my co-star, you need to be quiet. That's your only job is to be quiet and look cute, so that I can get a date. Okay, so where was I? Both men, age 37, plead not guilty to all the charges, including the rape and the incident of the assault with the barista. I guess it's a barista. I don't know what that is. Let me spell it out for you. B-A-R-R-I-S-T-E-R, -R -E telling the New South Wales District Court jury that all of the acts were consensual. The Chinese woman said during the attack, she was forced to perform a sex act on Wang. Wang is not the actor, he is the other guy. Who was lying on the bed in his room in the Sydney Shangri-La Hotel. At the time, Gao, that's why Gao, he's the actor, asked her if she was going to finish before the sun came up. And laughed at her, she said. He slapped her on the butt a few times and then complained the compliant to the, to the jury. Eh. Basically, she told that to the jury. She said YG, which is Wang, the, the gal dude, left the room soon after um, Wang began raping her. CCTV footage shows the gal leaving the room at 3.07 a.m., but an hour before the woman left. The woman told the police about the alleged incident, assault, and later that day, by wasn't until the following day, she alleged that she had been raped. She said she was scared and in shock during the first police interview. In China, no woman would report this kind of thing to the police because the famous people, they have got all the power in the world, she told the jury. So I guess the woman must have been of Asian descent as well. The woman, who um, couldn't be identified for legal reasons, worked as a crew with Gao and Wang in an Australian shot episode the Chinese series Love in what the hell? A R A N Y A. Okay, that's the name of the series. Alright. She told the court Wang repeatedly tried to kiss her during the rap party outside of the hotel before telling her people from the production that they were going to meet in his room. No one was there when she arrived, but she said she felt a bit safer with Gao arrived minutes later. He always was very polite and it is public figure and he he had got married and he has has a daughter and someone I can trust, she said. Told Gal wanted to chat with the woman, asked um, him if he wanted to talk about it. He said that they wanted to chat, what do you think we're going to have? Um, the response that she didn't know before she heard Wang talk in the bathroom and the words were to the effect of I'll leave. And then it was like her to you is what it says. Gal began kissing and undressing her before he pulled her into the bedroom and forced himself and forced her to perform a sex act on him. She said then she told the jury she said no on several occasions during the ninety minutes inside the hotel room. I was so scared it was a horrible room and I didn't know what to do. Boy, you blowing spit bubbles? Under cross-examination, Gal's barista 
How the frack do you say that? Um, we just gotta have to spell it out for y'all, and y'all just gonna have to bear with me on that. M U R U G A N T H A N G A R A J S C suggests that she told the Australian crew members a different story about the morning of March 27th, including that Gal and Wang were drunk and needed to be taken back to the hotel. I can't remember, she said. I'll never tell lies. The trial for the judge, Penelope Hawk, I don't know if I pronounced that right, H-O-C-K, continues. A Chinese film star struggled, um, excuse me, this is, uh, a Chinese film star laughed and slapped the Sydney woman as a male producer raped her in a luxurious hotel. Why did it start all over again? The woman gave a tear for evidence. Why in the hell did it start all over again? I've been scrolling down. Okay. Gal told uh, this thing went all the way back up to the top. Okay. So under cross examine, there we go. Under cross I already spelled that out. So she told Australian crew, blah blah blah. Need to go back to the hotel, blah blah blah. The trial judge, hello little Penelope Peacock, <laughs> continues. View the original article. This Lord snot drooling and stuff. Okay. So I'm gonna touch on this real fast. Oh, here's the uh, original article. I don't know why this. Um, yeah. Okay. So that's them. Again. So you guys can see his name. I can't pronounce that name. And this little. Turd here is asleep in the Shangri-La Hotel, which is my arm. Now, see, this goes into a little bit more detail. And then it stops. Then it goes into more detail. Let's see, where the hell are we? You got past telling Gal in the chat. Continue. How do I continue? Where do I go to continue? Okay. I guess I hit this number one here. And it took me right back to the top of the same damn thing. This is why I hate technology. Because technology only works for those who know what the hell it's supposed to do. So we're going to get off that. And I'm going to go to a different one. And this is one that's going to piss us all off. So we're going to go ahead and do that. And there's one under that that's going to piss us off. So I'm going to do two more with this right now. All right. <sighs> Middle school teacher pursued 13-year-old girl for sex, police say. This guy's black. He just ruined everything for black people. And black teachers specifically. And this dude almost like Tupac. Middle school teacher accused of seeing, seeking sex from a 13-year-old sent... Her obscene text messages requested photos, suggested that they smoke marijuana together. He's looking more like Tupac with that smoking marijuana thing. And Pines Police. Oh, excuse me. Primbrook Pine Police. I have no idea where that is. It all had to kept a secret. Their secret. A 26-year-old teacher and a junior varsity football coach at the Somerset Academy Charter School told a girl in the told that girl the police report said oh my god why do people have these fucking hoppy cappy names I want to say his name is Liverick but I don't know L-E-V-E-R-I-C-K Johnson of Miami was arrested at the school that I mentioned on Tuesday into a book he was booked into a Barwood County Jail um, it's four felony charges, solicitation, sexual battery, act of a minor, a custodian, cruelly towards children, and obscene communications with the child, and we will have to continue this when somebody's not stopping by my fucking door talking.